Hello, good day everyone. We are the group 4A of BSN 3D of the University of St. Lasalle. And I, Audrey Aravalo, along with my group members, Katrina Abong, Alisa Altaras, Alisa Marie Bailon, and Jerrel Hipolio will be presenting a research study entitled Level of Stress Among Nursing Students. To start off, Stress is an experience of tension or irritation caused by a reaction of a person to a situation that causes fear, excitement, or confusion. According to the research carried out by Shan Mugam, nursing students in particular experience a higher level of stress compared to other courses. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, many schools shifted to distance learning teaching methods and virtual online classes. The pandemic has produced anxiety and stress to nursing students since their course requires practice and exposure. Students had to quickly adapt to the new teaching format. Freshman students in particular are required to make even more adjustments since they must undergo different changes and also to adopt from senior high school to college life. Given this transition, the purpose of this study was to determine the levels of stress among first-year nursing students. For our objectives, this study aimed to determine the level of stress among first-year nursing students at the University of St. LaSalle. More specifically, this study aimed to answer the following questions. What is the profile among nursing students when categorized by section, age, and sex? What is the level of stress among nursing students as a whole and when categorized by section, age, and sex? Is there a significant difference in the levels of stress among nursing students when categorized by section, age, and sex? Methods. For the research design, the design that was used in determining the level of stress among nursing students was a descriptive quantitative design. Based on the nature of the study, a survey instrument was utilized. For the study sample, the participants of the study included the 170 first-year nursing students, which were computed using Slovin's formula. Participants were determined using stratified random sampling and the random digit interval. Here we can see the number of participants per section. For section A, there are 26 participants. For section B, 25. For section C, 24. From section D, 22. For section E, 24. For section F, 24. And for section G, there are 25 participants. Instrument. For the instrument that was used in this study is a standardized instrument called the perceived stress scale. The researchers distributed the survey on April 7, 2021 via Google Forms. The survey used a rating scale where response options range from never in the given situations to very often. The questions in this scale ask about the person's feelings and thoughts during the last month. In each case, the participants were asked to indicate how often they felt or thought a certain way. And now for our results. For profile of nursing students, in terms of section, most students that participated in the study came from Section A with 26 students, and the lowest number of 22 students came from Section D. This, however, was influenced by our sampling done with Slovin's formula. As for age, 149 of the students were aged 18 and 19 years old, while only 21 students were 20 years old and above. Lastly, for the sex of the participants, only 38 of the participants are male while 132 of the participants are female. For the level of stress among nursing students, as a whole, the mean score was 2.20, which is categorized as moderate perceived stress. Next, levels of stress by section resulted in a mean score of 2.20, which is interpreted as moderate perceived stress, with section F having the highest score of 2.33 and section G having the lowest score of 2.20. For levels of stress by age, those aged 18 to 19 years old had a mean score of 2.20, and those 20 years old and above had a mean score of 2.19, both of which are categorized as moderate stress. For stress level by sex, male students had a mean score of 2.11, while female students had a mean score of 2.23, both of which are categorized into moderate stress level. For the difference in the level of stress among nursing students when categorized by age and sex, for age, there was no significant difference in the age of the respondents and their level of stress. For sex, there was also no significant difference in the sex of the respondents and their level of stress. For the difference in the levels of stress among nursing students when categorized by section, 
there is no significant difference in the levels of stress among nursing students when categorized by section at a 0.05 level of significance. Conclusion. Based on the findings of the study, the researchers arrived at the following conclusion. Most of the first-year nursing students in the University of St. LaSalle that participated in the study belong to Section A. The majority of them are students aged 18 to 19, and most of them belong to the female group. Given that the nursing students are often subject to a variety of stressors that can directly or indirectly hinder their learning, success, and overall well-being of their body and mind, the University of St. LaSalle first-year nursing students were found to have moderate perceived stress. Almost all of the nursing students in the study experienced moderate stress, regardless of their section, age, and gender. It was also discovered that the section, age, and sex had no statistically significant effect on the perceived stress levels. Commendations. Survey students on their stress level. Effective counseling and stress management strategies for students. Curriculum optimization. Workshop or webinars on stress and effective coping strategies. Further research may explore the specific factors that exacerbate the stress among students relative to curriculum design, distance learning, and the effects of the pandemic. And that is all for our poster presentation. Thank you for listening.